What up, what up, what up, man? It is way too early, man. I'm getting freaking... I'm always ringing my doorbell and stuff, man. What the heck, bro? Oh, shoot. How in the heck? Damn, I'm gonna get up out this one, Joe. I gotta squeeze your body this one. Oh, yeah. Yo, we finally got this boy. Son Joe, appreciate it. Is it just me? Or is it that the UPS and FedEx, they be ringing your doorbell and they be out? Oh, shoot. They done dropped off my ties too, y'all. They done dropped off the Electsani boys. Damn. Where the heck they go? Ease, Ma, I tell you, boy. All right, so let me put this stuff in the garage. Yeah, so man, fortunately what it looked like, I hear a doorbell, I'm like, hey, let me hurry up and throw some clothes on, man. I was ringing my doorbell this early. Nigga, buck naked. <laughs> but yeah, man. Them mugs is box, box, boy. Look at that. Look at that. Hemi gang. Hemi boys. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, yeah. So y'all know what time it is. Yeah, y'all know what time it is. We're going to put these up in here. Just like that. Just like that. Just like so. Yeah, man. So I'm still trying to make moves, man. Of course, y'all know what I'm saying. I go through what I go through my everyday life, but... Still trying to do what I can for y'all. Damn, this mug dirty. Y'all see that? I want to wash that boy, but then it's going to be back in the rain, though. I don't know how I'm finna carry this with a hand like this. Uh, Well, we shall see. Yeah, all right, man, so pretty much these gonna be put on there. And I did figure out that I'm gonna get a wrap. I'm gonna probably just do a matte black. You know what I'm saying? Some, some keep it simple. So I'm gonna wrap that, put these on there. And these tires right there, they're the ones that's going on my back, back there so I can put them on, uh, so I can do burnout, so I can do my intro video, man, for all of this. You feel me? But I will. And later on, I will be doing an unboxing of this. So this is pressure washer, man, because I normally pay to get my car washed, you know what I mean? But I be tired of paying, because I normally go get, like, the hand detail, whatever, the full car. And I pay, like, $30 for it, and I figured, dude, I could make my money back in about three or four washes, you know what I'm saying, myself. And so, yeah, man, I just got this pressure washer, the Sun Joe, uh, 4001. Let me see if it got the... There you go, right here. The Sun Joe SPX 4001. Load high, you know what I'm saying? You can control it. Yeah, but I ain't, I ain't gonna talk about it now, you know what I'm saying? I'll wait to do that when I do an unboxing because I don't even really know that much. What up, what up, what up, what up, man? It's your boy, KG, man. Like I said, you finna get to this unboxing of this, uh, Oh, this pressure washer, man. This is the best pressure washer that's out. I mean, if you ask me, top of the line, one of the one of the best brands, Sun Joe. Uh, yeah, so uh, that's my feelings on it. Let's take a look. All right, so I got a knife already, as you can see. What's this way open? I want y'all to see. Look at the quality on this on this hose right here. I don't know what kind of material that is, but look, that's some good quality. Let's take it out.
Look at the quality on that hose. It's a pretty good hose, man. So this is supposed to be like, that's the little top, the little back strap or whatever. Here we got, what else? Get this bag out of here. This must be the bottom of it right here. How you pick this big old thing up? Okay. Let's get these little, little boxes out of here. What was in there? Nothing. Ain't nothing in these little boxes. This just a... This must be the sprayer. This is a nice little weight to it. It's not really heavy, but you can definitely tell it's some good material. I need to pick this up. Hold on. Like I did like reviews and everything, you know, I was talking about like when you use the pressure washers, when you when you start pulling on the cord, sometimes the pressure washers tip over and it's no good when you're trying to walk around a car and you got the whole thing tipping over from pulling on the cord. So uh, one of the, not necessarily the features, but um, one of the specs in regards to this is that it had more of its weight at the bottom, you know what I'm saying? So when you pulling on the hose, when you put it on a hose, it's not, it's not, it's not tipping over because it got a, it got a solid base. So, hey, we from, we from the hood, man. I gotta, gotta stay scrapped up. You know what I'm saying? Boop, boop, yeah, free. <laughs> I'm a fool, man. But yeah, I'm guessing this must go on here, something like that. I don't even know. But yeah, man, pretty much, uh, let me give y'all a quick, a quick rundown, you know what I'm saying? So that's the, um, that's the bottom of it. It's a good quality. I mean, just look at it. I mean, if you're ever looking in the market for a pressure washer, so you can wash your own cars, these are different little nozzles right here. If we, uh, if we give you, uh, there we go. Let me take this camera off. There we go. All right, so look. You got the little um, nozzles right there. So if you want a more defined spray versus a more wider spray, you got that. Some good tires. They like a, it's not plastic. As you see, I can, I can kind of scratch it. So it's like a, a, a plastic rubber type. Kind of what they got on the, the updated big wheels, the high price big wheels. But then you got your little caps here. You got your low, stop, high, minimum, maximum. I'm not sure what that's for. But yeah, here goes the, uh, this part. Probably goes on just like so. See, look, that was easy. We done low key put it together. And the thing about this is it got a reel. So, you know, so you can reel the hose back in when you're done with it versus being done, have to wrap it around and carry it and just, it just be a big mess, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I don't know, man. Tell me what y'all think. Tell me if y'all think this is a good, uh, a good pressure washer. I mean, once again, I'm gonna show you it's the uh, Sunjo SPX 4001. It's pretty the most, it's pretty much the new, most up-to-date model, um, up-to-date model that they have. And the reason that I got it is because I was truly, I was truly tired of paying thirty dollars for a car wash. I mean, I paid thirty dollars for like a full inside, outside, detail type car wash, vacuum, do the windows, do the whole shenanigans, and I was, I was tired of. I'm like, man, I just spent. It's a decent little Jeep right there. That boy was busting. But yeah, I mean, I could, I could buy me a pressure washer and make my money back in about three or four washes because look as you can see this car is dirty i don't know if the camera show you but it's dirty and so is this one but on the flip side you see all them clouds it was not sunny today it was not sunny at all like it's literally only been sunny like right now but yeah man down in the comment section man tell me what y'all think about the pressure washer if you want to know where I got it from, I got it from Amazon. I can put the link down below so y'all can see. 
like this video share this video subscribe to this video turn on the post notification bell so you can be notified whenever i put out a busting video because that's all i'm doing busting videos the hemi way the only way to do it the hemi boys way but i just want to let y'all know to stay tuned man stay with me all year long we're gonna be busting 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 so before we go, you know, I need y'all to do one thing for me, just like always. I know, I know, I know. But holla at your boy!